Welcome to the MWRC Smart Sports Competition. Teams must complete three tasks in robotic track and field competition, robotic basketball competition, and robotic football competition. Each team consists of two contestants and two Vincebots. The contestants must complete the relevant competition tasks within the set time. The complete venue for the Smart Sports Competition consists of three maps, which are the Robotic Track and Field Competition Task Area, the Robotic Basketball Competition Task Area, and the Robotic Football Competition Task Area. The referee determines the following task variables before the start of the competition. 1. Before programming, the referee randomly determines the color card color that the junior grade group needs to identify and the three-dimensional model that the senior grade group needs to identify in the robotic basketball competition task. Two, before programming, the referee randomly determines the starting position of the robot of the junior grade group and the placement of the goalkeeper of the senior grade group in the robotic football competition task. Before the competition starts, each team must modify the two robots so that robot number one can throw a basketball and robot number two can kick a football. In the robotic track and field competition task, robot number one starts from the starting area, passes through the green marking point and remains still for one second and lights up the green LED light, which get 10 points. Robot number one follows the black line to the yellow relay point, activates robot number two and gets 10 points. Robot number two runs along the black line to the red marked end point and gets 10 points. Robot number two stays still and lights up the corresponding color, LED light at the red marked endpoint, and gets 10 points. In the task for the senior group, robot number two needs to avoid an obstacle without touching, and gets 10 points. The full score for the junior group in this link is 40 points, and the full score for the senior group is 50 points. In the robotic basketball competition junior grade group task, if robot number one moves to the penalty area and any vertical projection is in the penalty area, he gets 10 points and identifies the color card pasted in the penalty area and light up the corresponding light, gets 10 points. If robot number one puts the basketball into the ball frame of the backboard of the corresponding color, gets 10 points. The full score for this link is 30 points. In the robotic basketball competition, senior grade group task, if robot number one moves to the penalty area and any vertical projection is in the penalty area, it gets 15 points and identify the three-dimensional model placed in the penalty area and displays the corresponding pattern on the screen, which gets 15 points. If robot number one puts the basketball into the ball frame of the backboard with the corresponding pattern, gets 10 points, and the full score for this link is 40 points. In the robotic football competition, junior grade group task, Robot number two moves from the starting point to the penalty area, and any vertical projection is within the penalty area, and it gets 10 points. Kicking the football into the goal gets 10 points. The full score for this link is 20 points. In the robotic football competition senior grade group task, robot number two moves from the starting point to the penalty area, and any vertical projection is within the penalty area, and it gets 10 points, kicking three footballs continuously into the goal for each gets 10 points. The full score for this link is 40 points. In the single competition, the total score of the team is robotic track and field competition score, plus robotic basketball competition score, plus robotic football competition score. The full score of the junior grade group is 90 points, and the full score of the senior group is 130 points. Before the competition starts, each team has 60 minutes of on-site coding and debugging time. After the competition starts, each team has two competition chances. The time limit for each competition in the junior group is 120 seconds, and the time limit for each competition in the senior group is 180 seconds. The participating teams must complete the competition tasks within the limited time. Each team takes a higher of the two competitions as its score and the team with the highest score ranks first. If the highest scores are the same, the team with a shorter time ranks first. If the score and the time of completing the task are the same, it is judged to be a tie. Come and join the MWRC Smart Sports Competition and experience the marvelous and exciting robotic games.